please feel free to ask questions as we go along. Uh, what can you tell us about the product? Sounds very innovative. Good question, and it is very innovative. But here's a quick question for you first. Who hates the sight of blood? I bet we're all scared of spiders too. Anyway, imagine you hate the sight of blood. But you have to prick your finger several times a day just to check your blood sugar levels. Yes? Sorry to interrupt, Jessica. That's okay. Please go ahead. When you say blood sugar, do you mean glucose? Glucose, exactly. Yes. Ah, oh, good. Thanks. I was wondering about that too. So, as I was saying, no more pricking of fingers. The Diab sensor uses a sensor to read the patient's glucose level. It collects the data through a patch on the skin and then sends it to a remote monitor. Basically, it's a reliable and pain-free way to manage diabetes. How big is it? Small, handheld. It weighs about 35 grams. How about I pass round a prototype for you to have a look? Excuse me, Jessica, can I just ask? I understand the components are made in China, is that right? Yes, they are made in China, but we assemble the product here in our Manchester plant, just across there, in fact. Any more questions? Yes, yes I'd like... <laughs> <laughs> yes, please, go ahead, Ed. Thanks. What was the reaction to the product? Very positive, actually. There are several articles in medical journals. I can send you some links. That would be great, thanks. So, no more questions? All right then. My assistant Carol will be here soon and she'll take you to meet the production team. That went really well. I had so many things I wanted to ask, but it was important to let others speak too. Such a relaxed, friendly atmosphere. I think I'm really going to enjoy working with these guys.